What is going on guys? Welcome to Greggles TV Daily, your source for daily tech news. Make sure you subscribe so you know what's going on in the world of tech. How's everyone doing? Hope you're having a fantastic day. We've got a great day of tech news for you and we're gonna dive and dive right in. So our first story of the day is about the Galaxy Z Flip 4 and some differences on this phone versus the Z Flip 3. Now I wanna tell you right off the bat, I'm not going to show you the images of what I'm talking about for, this is an official render that's leaked out of the Z Flip 4 and I don't wanna show it because of copyright reasons. This is when Samsung really dives in and like, it's like, if you show this image, we're gonna get you. And I don't want them to get me. I'm scared of them. I'm not scared of them, but I don't want to lose my channel. So I'm going to talk about, I'm going to show Z Flip 3 images, but I'm going to talk about what is different. So let's check this out. So the images that were leaked out officially are from 91 Mobiles, and they talk about the differences. And so just look at the Z Flip 3 here. They're saying besides the bolder colorway on the Z Flip 4, and you're gonna get darker antenna grooves as well on the Z Flip 4. Also, the buttons look slightly larger on the Z Flip 4, as well as more pronounced and clickier. Also more pronounced are the protruding camera lenses, so the cameras are gonna stick out more on the Z Flip 4. Rumored to offer a more premium imaging experience than with past models. The body itself also looks to be a bit less tapered towards the ends, perhaps to accommodate the larger battery that's also rumored to be on board. So thicker phone, because of the bigger battery, darker antenna lines, um, and thicker cameras. So think, I, I think of this as like a bold, move or bold changes when you think about if with text if you make it bold it just gets beefier and fattier and and, and and catches your eye more and that's what this Z Flip 4 is going to do. It's gonna be a bold. You can be like the Z Flip 3 bold. That's gonna really what it could be called. Uh, so very interesting stuff. Um, Again, I kind of said I'd probably pick it up, and which I might pick it up, but at the end of the day, it will probably, it's not gonna be my main phone. I'm a fold dude. I'm a fold dude. Next up, if you're the Galaxy Buds Pro like myself, there's a new update out. It's a little small update as usual, 2.3 you know, megs or so. Uh, you can pick that up if you go into your Galaxy wearable app and download the app. It doesn't really say it adds anything of total substance, but hey, maybe it'll fix some kind of bug that you have going on. And our last story of the day is about the Galaxy Z Fold 5. I said that right, Z Fold 5. Fold 4 is not even out, and we're already beginning to get rumors about certain specs of the Z Fold 5. This is wild. So this kind of happens, it tends to happen, you know, and but it's kind of wild. So let's talk about the Galaxy Z Fold 5. This tweet comes from Alvin, and he's got a pretty good track record, saying before the launch of the Z Fold 4 and Flip 4, we're now seeing reports about the Fold 5 and Flip 5. The Fold 5 will run the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2. It will use the 50 megapixel ISOCELL Gen 3 sensor for one of its rear cameras and a 12 megapixel front camera. So it looks like the Z Fold 5, at least initially of what we're hearing, is gonna have kind of maybe updated, but slightly similar cameras to what you get with the Z Fold 4. So if you're worried about like, oh, if I get the Z Fold 4, is the Z Fold 5 camera's gonna be crazy better? Well, on a megapixel level, it's gonna be basically the same. Um, so keep that in mind, but anything can change between now and then, but these are just, so these are really, really preliminary rumors, and it's just wild to think that like, of course they're thinking about building the phone, but like, it's, it, I think it's kind of crazy, like they're still a year away from that phone, more than a year away from that being phone released, and they're already talking about specs being inside the phone, which, you know, the processor, okay, yeah, they're gonna, they always use the Snapdragon, they always use the latest Snapdragon, and that will be for that, but like cameras, they're already saying like they're gonna go with the 50 megapixel instead of like the 108 megapixel, so it's kind of crazy stuff like that. But your question of the day would be, what would you want in the Z Fold 5? I think a lot of people are gonna say integrated S Pen, so I'll just say it. Um, for me, I'm, I think just a big fat battery inside is what I would really, really want. And it, to, again, I'd want it to be bigger. I'd want the, the front screen to be even bigger. I'd want the inside screen to be even bigger. And those are probably my biggest way and better cameras all the time. All the time, especially that under display camera. Thanks for watching. Uh, no questions today. I answered them in the thing. I'm just, I, you know, the questions are cool and I do them. Um, I'm, I'll be honest, I don't have a ton of time today, so it's kind of why I cut them out. So uh, have a great day. We'll see you down the road. Peace.